Hey and welcome back to my channel, I'm Daniel and today I will show you how you can use an external microphone on your Dell XPS. Because I have the problem every time when I want to record something with an external microphone, it always chooses the internal microphone. For example, here in this program, it's Premiere Pro, I want to do a voiceover with, for example, those headphones here because they're closer to my mouth or those ones and it doesn't work. What can you do? Number one, obviously always update the drivers. It sounds cliche, but you should do it because sometimes issues can come up with the drivers over time. Just be up to date with your drivers. In this machine, there is a Realtek audio driver. And back in the days, there was a Realtek HD audio manager where you could select what kind of stuff you plug in into your headphone jack. But on my machine, it doesn't show me anything. And it also, I couldn't find the Realtek HD Audio Manager. I was even thinking if I should install that one, but it made no sense because on the Dell website, it doesn't even recommend that I install that one. So the solution is super simple. Let's jump into my computer and I show you. So it's super simple. Go on your desktop and search here for Max Audio Pro. If you don't have this program installed, go to your Dell drivers on the Dell website and install the newest version of the Max Audio Pro. And when you open this one up, you will get a window like this. And here you click on the first one. And what you can do now is you go here to advanced and actually look if this one is clicked on. Show the pop-up di dialog when the device is connected. So this is actually everything you have to do because when you have this setting on now, I can actually change my headphone jack and put something new in. And it will ask me this new device. Okay, what is this device? Is it a headphone? Is it a headset? Or is it just a microphone? In this case, it's now a headset. So I hit OK. Boom. If you want to test your audio, you can actually type here in audio. And you have a voice recorder in Windows 10. So you can click the voice recorder and do recording. So test, 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 1, 2, 3. And what I'm doing now is I'm tapping on the microphone. This is how I always test if the microphone that I'm using is actually the one that I'm trying to use. And then I play back this one here, recording. So test, 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 1, 2, 3. And what I'm doing now is I'm tapping on the microphone. This is how I always test if the microphone that I'm using is actually the one that I'm trying to use. So here we are, super simple solution. It's really just one click if you know where to look for. The reason why it took me so many hours and maybe you as well is because I was not finding any solutions in the Windows settings. And if you don't have a Realtek audio, then maybe just find an audio manager that works with the drivers that you have in your machine. And the reason why this is a problem in the first place is back in the days we had two of those um, 3.5 millimeter jacks. So the headphones jack and the microphone jack and now it's a combo jack you have to tell the device which of them are you using right now see you in the next video if you like this video hit like subscribe ding a ding the bang bang gong and we see us bye i'm daniel